hello guys what is up in today's video we are going to show you how to stream on kick from your mobile phone now if you want to stream mobile games or if you just want to stream you walking around IRL streaming and you want to use your mobile phone you can do that with kick so how do we do that we need a few things we need to of course go to the play store or app store so here we go to the play store and we need two things we need stream labs as you can see here it says here stream labs live streaming you need this one and again, everybody knows how to download and install apps, right? It, it does it itself pretty much, right? So you need Streamlabs. After you've downloaded Streamlabs, you need to download Kick. So Kick has its own, um, its own live streaming app here. As you can see here, we have them both. So let's go and go here. As you can see, we have Kick, we have Streamlabs. Now, what I want you to do is to make sure, of course, if you're doing IRL streaming, you know you're walking around you're gonna have your your camera right or make sure that you already have the game or games that you want to stream as you can see we have for example here we have wild rift we have brawl stars so how do we do this we need to go to streamlabs first right so click on streamlabs like so and here again we, we we've covered streamlabs before and this is going to be the annoying thing about streamlabs is every time you open it, it's going to have this pop-up, start recording or casting with Streamlabs. If you're not going to stream, immediately click cancel. Now, you're going to be brought to this screen. Now, this screen, you're going to see there's a hamburger icon or those three lines on the upper left corner. Tap on that and you're going to be brought to this option. Now, if you click on account, account settings, as you can see here, you're going to have options here. You're going to have Twitch, YouTube. Twitter, Facebook, TikTok, and Trovo, but there is no kick. So how do we stream on kick using Streamlabs? It's very easy. You just need to click on custom RTMP, click setup like this. And here you're going to need to fill up three things on this pop-up. It says custom RTMP. Please fill in to set up custom RTMP. So the name would be kick, right? And here you're going to be asked a URL and a stream key. Now, how do we get that? If we go, let's let's minimize this. If we go to kick, right? And again, you need to be, well, you need to be signed in on your kick. Uh, if you tap on the upper right corner of the screen, your profile, as you can see, there is no settings option. There's channel, block channels, notifications, legal, and language. How do we get our stream key and our URL? It's very easy. You need to go sign in on your desktop or laptop and we're gonna do that right now all right so we are now on our desktop and we are now signed in on kick at kick.com and as you can see you're signed in so how do you get your stream key it's very easy so what you want to do is click on the upper right corner your profile icon it's a little it's a little picture here click on that a small pop-up will appear and what you want to do is click on settings so once you click on settings you're going to be brought to the creator dashboard now if you look on the left hand side of the screen going to have settings under it it's going to have profile stream key security and notifications now how do you get your stream key from desktop let's click on that how do you get this from your desktop to your mobile it's very easy uh again this is going to be your stream url and this is going to be your stream key so how do you get this all you need to do is click on this click copy as you can see you copy to click, uh copy to clipboard and then either a notepad or if you have your own private um discord channel and what you want to do is just copy both as you can see i've already copied it these are the same just co copy and then paste here and then copy again the stream key this time and then paste here now now that you have this you don't you don't need to uh be here anymore so what you want to do is of course you need to have your discord uh on your phone as well you need to have the discord app on your phone open your discord and as you can see here it is connected i am signed into both uh mobile and desktop on stream uh on discord so it's very easy let's just click the url click copy text just hold again hold and then click copy text right and then minimize this go to streamlabs again and hold again and click paste so that's our url now we go to a stream key we need to go back to discord again and again hold 
and this pop-up again will appear click copy text now we can go out of discord and we don't need to go there anymore because our job is done go back to streamlabs and here click on that and click tap on paste and then there you go you have your name you have your url and now you have your stream key all you need to do now is tap save and as you can see once you do that it's going to ask you to start recording or casting with streamlabs now we don't want that to do we don't want to do that yet so tap cancel again so save username and password no <clears throat> that's not part of the the video anyway so what you want to do is tap on this again switch between scenes default so again click on the top right top left i mean the three lines hamburger icon and here you're going to have new options now since you have uh <clears throat> enabled the kick uh, option for your streaming you have themes you have scenes you have rewards you have disconnect protection alerts account settings streaming settings and advanced settings now the ones that have uh the border the somewhat rainbow border these are ultra these are streamlabs ultra for your mobile so if you tap on upgrade to ultra it's going to ask you for monthly or yearly as you can see here it's 915 pesos for monthly and seven over seven thousand yearly so that's around over a hundred over a hundred uh, dollars per per year so if you want to do that if you really want to invest just get the yearly if you can afford it but when it comes to themes if you tap on themes it's going to give you preset themes that you can use but then again like what i said these are these are paid right these are premium with disconnect protection you won't go offline and lose all your precious viewers so if you lose connection you're not going to go offline you have production right um but what we want to do is tap on scenes because this is going to matter why do you ask that well it's because it depends on what you're streaming if you're streaming a mobile game you need uh you need your stream to be uh horizontal the right one if you're streaming irl if you're walking around if you're on a vacation if you're vlogging you want the default one the vertical one right so make sure that you have the right streaming setting so that your stream won't look wonky or weird right so again let's step back if you go to account settings again as you can see here this is pretty much it just you know to double check that if you go to stream settings you, you, this is where you could fix your audio settings video settings events list platform settings advanced settings and privacy settings if you tap on audio settings this is where you could tweak your microphone and your internal audio internal audio means if you play a game it's going to be the game's audio and sounds right so just make sure you could just um <clears throat> tweak it to your liking you can also tap on more audio options uh and just figure these out right after that go to video settings so this is going to be your resolution your output resolution right if you want 720 if you want 1080 just do that expected frame rate if you want to do 60 do 60 and so on and so forth so you can just tweak it as much as you want and then after that once you're done go back go back and then go back you're going to be asked to stream tap start now and here you're going to have an option to tap go live once you tap go live of course you need to have your game or your camera ready just tap go live and you will be good to go so that's pretty much it that's the video hope you liked it like comment share subscribe ring that bell icon we'll see you on the next one